Keeping it real, keeping it real. Keeping it real, keeping it real. Keeping it real with Reverend Laura. Gay Hendricks talks about time, and he talks about it in two different ways. He talks about Newtonian time, which is that linear, sequential, 60 seconds in a minute, 60 minutes in an hour, 24 hours in a day, finite time. And then he talks about what he calls <clears throat> Einstein time. Now, Einstein time is fluid. Einstein time is what you experience when you've been working at something that feels like you've been doing it for 20 minutes and you look at the clock and it's four hours later. That's Einstein time. The Greeks have another way of expressing this. They call that linear time chronos. That's where we get the word chronometer from. Chronos is that linear. Again, 60 seconds, 60 minutes, 24 hours, seven days a week. That's that time. It's finite, it's limited, it's sequential, and there's no fluidity in it. But they have another concept that they call kairos. Kairos comes from the Greek god of opportunity. Kairos was a Greek god of opportunity. And uh, the term was used first in archery. Back in the Greek days, there was that moment that the archer has pulled back the bow and the bow, the arrow is ready to be released. And there's that instantaneous moment when all possibility exists. All potentiality is available right in that second. It's just, it's, I don't even know that you could quantify the time. It's just that instant. And then they let go of the bow. They let go of the arrow. And it does what it does. But before they let go of it, those seconds before it, all possibility existed in it. Every, every, every condition, every thing that could possibly happen existed right in that moment. That moment was full of opportunity. It was an opportunity to hit the target, miss the target, somewhere in between that. So this Kairos time that we work with, it's um, a moment for us to find that exceptional opportunity that's available all the time. When we can work in that idea that there is not this finite time, we, we, we can let go of the idea that says that I'm 62 years old and I should be retired and not doing anything every day. We can let that go because there, every single moment of my life is not dependent on anything else. Every single moment of my life is a new opportunity, a perfect now, a perfect time where all potentiality exists, where everything that is possible in my life exists within that, that instantaneous moment of um, possibility. Keeping it real with Reverend Laura.